is finally nice outside and so I can finally go back to working on an RV. I have a bunch of, well two tubs really, of crap. All this stuff is going to go out to the, out to the RV. Uh, just like random kitchen stuff here, tools, and then this box right here is just full of just random things. It's just full of random, random whatevers. Uh, all my, all the bottom of my cabinets are completely cleaned out, so the only thing that's left is actually food and then like real dishes. Um, and then I like a handful of like little things that uh, I'm able to, I can take out. But uh, I think I think I lost my engine key to the RV. Uh, it's this weird like triangle looking old computer desk or old file cabinet desk key um, it's got the end like a file cabinet key but it's like a big triangle thing and I took it off the keychain because it was weird when I was work when I was working on the engine and now I don't know where it's at so it sounded like more or less that I lost it I just can't find it good news is I found my engine key <laughs> so it's actually I guess I put it on the counter in the RV and it like slid into the sink so, there's no disposal or anything, and there's guards and all that, so it just fell into the sink. But I found it, so now I can add it to my keychain. It is trash day, trash, trash, trash. Like, there's so much crap going on in my house right now. It's really not even, like, I'm just taking all the crap from everywhere and just pushing it into one room, really. So, as you can see, there's crap just everywhere. Some of it doesn't even belong here. Some of it's getting thrown away. Actually, most of it's getting thrown away. That's what I'm doing today. I just 07 from Olympus, so I'll be very scarce on there for the next couple weeks uh, until I actually leave because um, I'm going to be moving my computer last. But today is completely, I'm just throwing crap away. Like all this stuff is finally gone. I have a TV up there. I got to double check to make sure this TV still works. If it doesn't work, it's going in the trash. I got a bedroom TV. I'm probably just going to give it to Goodwill. Um, a lot of stuff. I'm just I'm just giving stuff away at this point. I have my main TV here. It's a 47 inch. That's actually going. That's actually getting sold to a friend for like 150 bucks. Nothing. Uh, everything's getting moved to the garage. Uh, I got a bunch of. I think I already took out everything out of my bottom cabinets here. So yeah, they're completely empty. It's uh, either most of it's most of it's either sold given away or it's already in the RV. I got a pile of crap that needs to go into the RV here. So just tools and random shit. Uh, a couple of tubs right here that I gotta put smaller stuff in just so just so I can take it out in an easier manner than one at a time. Uh, but yeah I just gotta I gotta go through my medicine cabinets. I have like random shit. Like I, I think I still have I think I still have like um, baby thermostat, binky thermostats from forever ago. I have a bunch of washcloths and towels I'm not taking with me. So like all this, like trash, trash. Most of this is trash. Most of this is trash. That's going with me. Some of this is trash. Uh, trash, 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 trash. Like all that's trash. Go in here. Everything in here is trash. I still have like just random, random shit. So that's trash. Uh, that's the bathroom that I have. It's super dark. My bathroom, I think most everything's out of there except for like my main use of stuff like razors, cologne, uh, deodorant, stuff like that. Uh, everything else is trashed or gone out of there. Uh, I got a couple extra tubs that take some big things. I got. I, I have some dedicated tubs. I have one dedicated tub for dog stuff like her food and leash and blah blah blah. Uh, I got another tub that's going to be dedicated for um, uh, like grilling stuff. Uh, like I have all my grill tools and charcoal and it, it already has a grill in it. So I have one so it's going to have charcoal um, my like little fire starter thing, I don't remember what it's called, chimney or something like that. That's going in there, lighters, um, newspaper, whatever I, whatever I can get to light it. Uh, I think I have a phone book actually that I use. 
uh, it's if you guys even know what a phone book is anymore. Uh, and then I just have like a random tub of whatever else I want to put the store away. And it's all going to go under the chassis or in the like luggage compartments. But yeah, today is just, I'm pretty much going through everything, just dumping it all in the trash. And I got a handful of paperwork still I got to go through. I'm just, I don't even know what it is. Uh, but yeah, that's, that's today. Just getting rid of all the trash. I thought I had a coax cable going through here, but apparently I didn't. So what I have, I have this like line feeder thing. This right here. And what it's for, it's for feeding like um, electrical lines through walls and stuff. Um, and I'm going to use it for this. Because up here, there's a, there's a little itty bitty tiny hole. I don't even know if you can see it back here. But way back here in the corner, there's one little hole that all the wires need to go through. And I only have a power cord coming through here. So my plan is, I'm going to take this, I'm going to pull the power cord back through with the with the line wrangler I guess attached to it and then once it gets pulled through I'm gonna attach uh, my HDMI cable my uh, coax RCAs whatever I need to come back to this hole attach it to here and pull it again but coming this way this time so it's gonna go through hopefully then come back through so I got everything bundled up here I got uh, well, I got the power cord obviously. You can see here's the this is the metal rod right here. But I got the power cord in here still. Um, I have RCA cables, HDMI, and I think that's it. Um, I don't think I need an Ethernet. I don't even have an Ethernet on my on my monitor, so I don't think I need that. So I have to get this big knot right here, this big bundle, through an itty bitty little hole, but. You guys know how the action works. If it doesn't fit, just push harder, right? So that's uh, that's my plan here. Hopefully I can get this through easy peasy. Once I get through that hole, it's like the whole thing back here is completely open. Everything back here is completely open. It's just this one itty bitty little hole right there. I got to get it through. So let's see how that works. It took some pulling and some working around, but missing success. I got all four of these wires here that we needed. We got uh, our coax, our power, uh, RCA, and HDMI. Got them all fed back through this hole using this line. So now we're just going to take all this tape off right here, and we'll wind it's all, we'll wind that back up, and then get everything plugged back into the TV, and we'll be good to go. All right. I need to cut my hair badly. Um, as you can see, I cleaned out all the cabinets, well, most of it. Um, a lot of the stuff here, like uh, these plates, that microwave, I think I'm going to keep that microwave here, I don't know. But um, the plates and all this, this is trash or going to Goodwill or something. Uh, a lot of this stuff here is actually going in the RV because it's plastic, so I'm not worried about it breaking. Uh, all this stuff's cleaned out. I mean, I got some crackers and uh, like this is, this. these two cabinets right here are food. Same with these here. Um, so I'm not really too worried about them right now. Uh, but I've been moving stuff around. I still got stuff in the fridge. But it'll definitely be a last thing. But I got, I've been filling this stuff up all day. All this is going in the RV. Uh, most of the stuff I'm not even keeping. Like these two things right here. This jug and uh, that bread maker my mom want. So I'm going to take it down to her. But um, so I, just, and I have like a handful of other things in the RV that are, I'm just transporting them really. Um, but yeah, I'm slowly getting everything going. My, uh, this is cleaned off of all the crap. I'm gonna get rid of all these dishes, or I have, uh, like these containers that hold, you know, whatever you want, sugar, flour. Those are gonna go in the trash, because I don't need them. But, uh, I'm only gonna keep plastic wear in the RV. Uh, one from it bouncing around everywhere. Uh, I don't have to worry about it, like, falling and breaking or whatever. Uh, and then two, plastic is much easier to clean than something metal or ply or whatever the stuff is. Whatever, whatever plates are made out of. Um, I know the word, I just can't think of it. But, uh, pour some, right? I don't know what these are made out of. Got a plate right here. What is this? It is currently made out of 
no idea. I don't know what plates are made out of. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. I'm pretty much just on the on the up and up and just moving things to the RV. It's gonna take me about another week to finish filtering and sorting through everything. Um, Cause I have a lot of a lot of just useless crap. Like everybody's got their junk drawer, you know, in their house. I have about seven of them. So I gotta go through all that. What I need, what I don't need. And then yeah. So I'm ready to hit the road as soon as I get everything sorted. I already have people that are leasing out my house. Uh, I have the paperwork ready. I just got to do the signing stuff. Do all the signing stuff uh, where I can collect the money and then the house is there for the next year. So, and it's already ready. But uh, I'm, I'm not ready to move yet, so I haven't had them sign it. So, but yeah, that will, uh, that's the end of that. I think, the, I think my next vlog that I'm going to be doing is either hitting the road or another update on what I'm doing to hit the road but uh, yeah everything else is pretty much done like I just got miscellaneous crap to get rid of and that's about it well later nerds